Okay, so today I'm going to be showing you how to clean a volleyball. So, I this is only for leather volleyballs. Um, I don't think this will not work if you do not have a leather volleyball. So make sure it's leather. You can tell between foam and leather because the leather is usually more, it stains easily. So what I suggest doing is taking a cloth and pour, taking a little water and scrubbing some dirt stains lightly or some stains if you have it on, have any stains on there, um, rub it on the stain, rub some water. And then, like, gently, like, like this. Not like, but just like, like that. So, um, if you do have a leather volleyball, this is a video for you to clean your leather volleyball. Not your foam. And the foam one will usually be much softer. So you like you hear that contact with me. Like it's usually a harder ball, so if it's harder, um so your I have um I don't there are different solutions. I don't like I just have this um gold glass cleaner leather cleaner so if you have that you can just put it on there put it on a cloth put it on your so you rub it on the cloth so wait so you're gonna So you're going to put a, some on your cloth, and then you're going to rub it in. Like so. Like that, so it's just evenly spread out. And you're going to put your cloth over your volleyball, and just rub. So watch. You're just going to rub it on your volleyball. Like this. All over your volleyball. So then after you finish that, you are going to have to go and get a dry one. So let me see if I have one. Hold on, I'll be right back. use this damp one it's a little damp but um, I will suggest for you guys to use a clean dry one because it's gonna make your volleyball all slippery if you do water over this stuff because it's trying to lubricate it so hold on Okay, so I'm back. So you can also use pivot towels. Um, so I use, like I said before, I use this gold boot. Like I said before, I use this gold, gla gold glass rich leather cleaner slash conditioner. Um, or you can find, like, um, they also have... Uh, they have um, some online or in stores, um, sometimes sporting stores. You can find, like, um, if you search up uh, varnish for volleyball varnishing cleaner or volleyball cleaner or varnish, volleyball varnishing, 
Um, I think something should come up. Um, I will post it down below. In the, I will post down some links in the description below if you want to buy some to clean your volleyball. So, um, I then again, so recap. Um, you're going to put this gold glass gl or any kind of like leather cleaner. And if your seams are like really dirty, you take a toothbrush, put some of that on, and I luber I put some water and soap on it, and I just scrub, just scrub in between the seams. And you can also, if you prefer to, you can rub this, like, you can take it, let me get some on my toothbrush, so you, you get it on your toothbrush. And then you just rub your rub your thing with the toothbrush like all over it. And it spreads it evenly and it gets it and it gets a good scrub. Now you might have to use a like sponge, but I suggest using a gentle being gentle with it. Because that's a good way to break it. So I would definitely not use like the rough side of the sponge. Like maybe if there's like one or two rough spots on it. But other than that I would not use um, a rough a rough um, like the side of the sponge. Like, there is a few spots on my thing. So I scrub them with the toothbrush. But there might be stains that won't come off. Like sometimes I stains that won't come off. So I take and I try a toothbrush, I try a cloth, I try a leather cleaner, I try everything and nothing gets it off. So I take the sponge, I put all my cleaning stuff on it, I soak it in that for a little and then I like, I scrub it and that usually gets it off. So I usually use like rubbing alcohol and this leather cleaner. This leather cleaner though, don't put it in water. It doesn't work in water. So, like, don't let it dissolve in water. Um, because I didn't read directions at first. The first time I used this, I did not use directions. And I put it in the water because that's usually, that's sometimes, because it was, like, this stuff is, like, not, it's, like, cream, kind of. It's kind of like a cream, like a body lotion. It's, like... It, it looks like you would use it for, like, it looks like a body lotion thing. It looks like body lotion if you squeeze it out. So I thought, oh, maybe you have to put it in water and it activates it or something like that. Whatever you want to call it. But that didn't work. So don't put it in water. It did not work. So now let's try Now your volleyball is all clean, and usually this varnishes it. So if you have an older one and it's not shiny anymore, this can this will shine it up. So this is also a conditioner right here. This um, the gold glass thing is also a conditioner. It's a it's a cleaner slash conditioner. So um, it also conditions it. Gets it shiny. So, um, and you can also write your name on this. It makes it clearer, especially when you have, like, a white one. See, mine has white strips on it. So I like to clean mine because I want to put my name on it. Now, with the Sharpie, I think if you put your name in Sharpie. Oh, you can't see me, can you? So I think if you put, um, Sharpie... I think if you put Sharpie on your thing, it might come off. I don't know. Um, I've never actually put my name on this because I've never needed to. But, yeah, you can absolutely definitely try that. Um, I mean, so I have a Wilson one and all of them are different. But you can definitely... Like, um, hold on.
But you can definitely use this Wilson glass cleaner. Um, it definitely works. And it conditions it too. So it's good to play. So it's good to play with and stuff like that. So yeah. I would definitely I rate this a good I love my gold glass cleaner because it it works. It cleans my volleyball, it makes it all nice and smooth. And I don't have to say, oh no, my ball. I don't like my friend, she has a brand new volleyball. But volleyballs are pretty expensive. So I don't have to go look at her volleyball, it looks so clean. And it's really good for, like, I know I like to have, like, clean stuff for my friend. I'm a neat freak. So, when things, when my thing is messy, it bothers me. And if you're a neat freak and you can't have things that are dirty, like, even, like, if a window that's dirty bothers you. Like, that is, having a cleaner is great for your volleyball. If you have a volleyball, I think this works on... This works on anything leather. The gold glass works on anything leather. Leather seats, leather... So like if you have a leather soccer ball, leather volleyball, leather basketball, anything that is leather, it will work on. So I don't know if I, I, I know some volleyball though. I know that volleyballs are leather. But I don't know what what other things are leather, but um, you can use it on anything leather. That's my conclusion. Like, you could use it on seats. Anything leather. Anything. And I mean anything. Like, I literally, I wash my, I have a leather, um, I have some leather furniture. We squeeze it on the furniture, wipe it on, done. Clean, bright, vibrant. So yeah, that is a way to clean your volleyball. Come on. There we go. But yeah, so this is my volleyball. Nice and squeaky clean, shiny. Okay, so good night and